Welcome to the official IG Black Swan Battle, a one-on-one -on -one battle between top analysts and key players for the Black Swan Crown. Hello, I'm Hebe. I'm the IG Market Analyst for Emerging Market. I'm based in Melbourne, Australia. Today, I'm going to showcase some of the lady power from the South Hemisphere. My name is Carl Henrik Soderberg, and I'm the Market Analyst in Sweden. And I'm really looking forward to give Hebe Shen uh, a lesson here. Let the Black Swan battle begin. So the exchange rate that preset or fixed by the Swiss National Bank was 1.2. So that's 1.2 of Swiss franc versus 1 euro. The minimum was 120, I, I think. I'm pretty sure. The SMB first introduced the pack back in 2011. Uh, the SMB first introduced the pair, I believe, in uh, 2011. The reason why the SMB packed the exchange rate in between the Swiss franc and euro was back at that time the Europe financial crisis, which meaning that there's quite high demand for the Swiss franc and which has pushed up the value for that quite substantially. So by fixing that and keeping a stable exchange rate for Swiss francs stabilized the market at that point of time. They did tie the franc to the euro because, uh, well, first you had the euro crisis that spoke the markets and the franc, that's always been a classic safe haven. It became popular and the Swiss franc was soaring and, uh, well, the SMB, they're very keen about the Swiss economy. The export sector is pretty big, so they wanted to, to keep the franc down against the euro. So, so they created this ceiling. They were printing new money to buy foreign currency, for example, euros, to, to keep the franc at a low level. The unpacked by the SMB definitely have quite a significant impact on the currency market as well as the stock market. The Swiss franc jumping up as much as 20% just following the decision. In the stock market, the Swiss stock market dropping as much as 8% on the day, given this such a huge surprise shock to the investors. So what happened was that the Swiss franc was surging 20%. Uh, the euro weakened sharply. European government bonds yields fell as well. And uh, the Swiss stock market was down 15%. Another measure that SMB introduced to prevent the quite unexpected surging of the Swiss franc is they also cutting the interest rate to minus 75 basis point to balance the big impact to the Swiss franc at that point of time. Oh, uh, I have to be honest, I don't know. That's a very tricky one. <laughs> Sorry, I don't have the exact answer for that. Mm. No idea. And the winner is... Wow, I knew it. I knew it for the beginning. That's very intense. But thank you, Carl. I just can't wait to rematch with you again next time. Congratulations, Hibi. Um, well, a well-deserved win. Uh, so, yeah, it was a good match. It was fun competing against you. So, see you next time.